The acting U.S. ambassador to Seoul says President Trump's recent visit helped boost bilateral ties and friendship with South Korea. Mark Napper also noted there's a strong chance South Korea will purchase more state-of-the-art military assets from the United States. Park Jong Hong with the details. The recent state visit by President Trump has clearly brought South Korea and the United States closer together. The acting U.S. ambassador to Seoul, Mark Napper, said both countries were able to confirm the strong bilateral alliance and their collaborative approach toward the North Korea nuclear issue. In particular, he said Presidents Trump and Moon Jae-in were able to nurture their friendship. It's great that they've, they've reached this point now where they, they can be friends and, and speak very clearly and, and in a good personal way with each other. He added that both leaders reconfirmed their desire to work together on bilateral trade. Napper stressed that the words of praise given by President Trump at the National Assembly on Korea's economic rise was a rare and welcome event. How much we value our relationship with Korea and how high our respect is for Korea's achievements, but also how concerned we are about not just the North Korean nuclear and missile programs, but about the situation in North Korea for, for the North Korean people. I think this is something the president cares very deeply about. When asked about the purchase of U.S. strategic military assets, Napper said the leader saw eye to eye that Seoul needs to secure the best possible defensive systems available. These include the F-35 and Apache helicopters that have already been approved for purchase and the P-8 Poseidon maritime patrol aircraft for which talks are still pending. Napper also welcomed the agreement between South Korea and China to mend bilateral relations that have been frayed by the deployment of the THAAD missile defense system. Park Jong-hong, Arirang News.